what is going on guys and welcome back to another episode of detroit become human we are now with luther cara and little old alice in the back there as you can see luther is neutral alice is trusted okay oh, this car's cool turn on don't think we want the radio on to be honest weather um car destination do destination these people we're going to see how do you know about them overheard androids Laco captured they said they were humans helping androids across the border what if it was a lie or just another trap all i know is those androids believed it until Zlako killed them hmm. we talked to alice no car weather i've never seen snow before it's pretty it's slowing us down but at least we won't meet any humans along the way that's a good thing can still turn it on uh, let's just keep talking to him. Distance. Is it much farther? We should arrive in an hour or so. Okay. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. This doesn't look good. No, it does not look good. But that looks cool. Stay inside, Alice. Exit. Let's get out of this damn car. Inspect car engine. Okay. Yeah, that's never a good thing. Okay, what it's got to keep. Do? I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. It's 30 degrees. Alice won't make it. Do have to tell Alice where, to spend the night. where we're going? We'll take her with us. Okay. No where we can stay around here, Carol. No, there's nothing. Pirate's Cove. Okay. Over there. Okay, we got Carl with us. That's good. I was worried there for a second she was still in the car. Amusement park. Okay, well maybe there's a little uh, hideout spot we can get into or something. We need to find right. shelter. We All have right. to get out of the cold. Looks like it's Oh, I keep cutting you off. Sorry, Luther, my guy. For a while. You think? That's not creepy. Oh, this place is hella creepy, bro. I don't want to be here. Why would you want to be here? Beware! Danger always comes when least expected. Okay. Not creepy at all. What's this down here? Who's this guy? Anyone we can talk to? Examine. Welcome to Whoa. Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Man, they just left them here? Man, that's cold. No pun intended. Yeah, that ain't creepy, bro. This place is falling apart. Yeah, no shit. It's not gonna be easy to find shelter. 
Anyone else we can go? Okay, let's have a look over here. See what see what this is about. Look safe inside. That's good. Let's do that then. How do we get in? Alright. Here we go. I think we found somewhere we can stay. Rip off. I'll this. You go, buddy. Good thing we got Luther. Here we go. Thank you. I appreciate you. No. Let's settle in for the night. I'll get a fire going. Oh man, I didn't mean to pick that up. I didn't think it was this damn thing. I don't know what they're for. No clue. But they don't seem to do anything for me, so. Okay. A lot of stuff here. What's this? Okay. Was this going to be like a blanket and uh, okay, making a bed? All right. Where's the fire? I'm guessing we have to put it up by the fire. Is that the fire? Yeah, I think it's the fire. I'll make the fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. All right. Good man. Alice? Do you think we'll be like them someday? Optimistic, realistic, sincere. Let's be optimistic. Border, we can start over. You can go to school. Maybe I'll find a job. We'll be like them. Like everyone else. Here's to hoping, eh? As long as we're together, that's all that matters. Come on. Let's get you to bed. All right, check Luther's bag. Is his bag? Check gun, offer cookie, leave. Right, let's just leave. Leave his bag. Leave his bag alone, that's his stuff, not ours. Um, what's this? That's that damn magazine, I do not want to read that again. Just that we're all safe, that's good. We all good. Tuck Alice in. Let's do that. Let's get her to bed. Mm, reassure, console, kiss. Give her a kiss. Sleep tight, Alice. Sweet dreams. Seems like that was the Can right thing to do. Can you tell me a story, Kara? I have 9,000 children's stories in memory. I should have one for you. Princess? This is a story about a princess who... No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. Oh damn, I'm not good at this. This is a story about a little girl. Unhappy, fear, alone, uh, unhappy. Who wasn't very happy. 
She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but... Impossible shadow, different. The shadow that lived within her kept her from being happy. Then, she met a robot. Who wasn't very happy either. So they decided to run away together. Better life, live in peace. To better try life. To find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but but they stuck together. So they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met a giant, a guardian, a robot. Bit of a guardian. Robot. Who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? Realistic, more happy end. They reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings. But real life isn't like that. Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us tomorrow. Are you going to come say good night, loser? Yes. Yes, of course. I mean, sometimes you get happy endings. Not all doom and gloom. Alice, sleep tight. <laughs> night and night. Talk to Luther. All right, buddy. Let's have a chat. Where are you going? She's a sweet girl. Yes. She's very brave. Snow, plants, Luther's past. Do you remember anything from your life? Before Zlatko? No. My model was designed to carry heavy loads. I might have been a longshoreman or a laborer. Who I was doesn't matter anymore. It wasn't really me. Do you know what you're going to do when you reach Canada? I haven't really thought about it. I've never been free before. Free? <laughs> I like the sound of it. Hmm. But I don't know what it really means yet. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? What? No. What do you mean? What the? What the hell's going on? Oh, now this ain't Walking Dead. Go away. Uh, what's the choice? I don't care about anything else. Just protect Alice. Yeah, I was betting on uh, Luther to grab that gun. Question, push back. Question? Who are you? What do you want? Leave us alone! Don't be afraid. We don't want to hurt you. We're just like you. Our name is Jerry. We were working you? here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. Oh, yeah. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. She looks sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in... Oh, she should follow us then. 
Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. On, Kara. I don't think you have any choice. Luther will protect us anyway. Yeah, there you go. You go get him. I feel safe. All right, let's go. Ah, uh, are we gonna go uh, right on this thing or something? Be our guest. A load of Jerry's. What we gotta do? We gotta go in here? Really? Oh, turn it on. Ah, that's nice, man. Kind of pretty. Climb on board. The carousel is about to begin. Help Alice. All right. Oh, this is nice. Thought it was gonna turn into a horror for a second, but it didn't. That's good. Very nice. It's the first time I've seen her smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately. Kind of creepy, that guy, not gonna lie to you. All these Jerry's. Damn. Okay. A nice little end into their bit. Alright, now we're with Hank and Connor. Let's get out of the damn car, bro. Alright. So, is anything. That's a damn magazine. I ain't even gonna bother. Anything else we need to get? No. Alright. Don't look like it. Unless there's something over here. No. It's just Hank in the magazine. So let's go to Hank. Man, what a view. Kind of pretty. Nice view, huh? That's what I'm saying. I used to come here a lot before. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? Oh, it's just me. Photo or suicide? Why are you so determined to kill yourself? Some things I just can't forget. Whatever I do, they're always there. Eating away at me. I don't have the guts to pull the trigger, so I kill myself a little every day. That's probably difficult for you to understand, huh, Connor? Nothing very rational about it. Or go back, stop drinking. Before, Before what? Hmm? You said I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before. Before nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. Hmm. RA9. Well, that's an unlocked one, so let's do that. What they have in common is this obsession with RA9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program androids believing in God 
Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem That's pretty theory. occupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls. They just wanted to be together. They really seemed in love. Rational deviants are not it called rational? They can simulate human emotions, but they're machines. And machines don't feel anything. What about you, Connor? Do you look human? You sound human? But what are you really? Neutral, defensive, aggressive, cold. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your That's partner, good. Your nice. buddy to drink with, or just a machine designed to accomplish a task. You could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot Connor? Uh oh. Some Mo scruple suddenly entered into your program. I'm down, buddy. Uh, lie, truth, lie, truth, truth. No. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. See, that's good. Okay. Not good. I could kill you. Don't do that. You would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? Yeah. Yes, no, not alive, logical. Let's be, let's be logical that, about this. Lieutenant. Destroying me at this point would deal a blow to the investigation. No. And have negative consequences for your personal situation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Defy Hank's anger, ironic. Hank's anger? I don't know. Where does all your anger come from, Lieutenant? Some unresolved trauma in your past? You think you're so fucking smart. Always one step ahead, huh? Tell me this, smart ass. How do Talk I show. know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Path unlocked. Where are you going? Get drunker. Get drunker. I need to think. Enjoy, buddy. Damn. All right, so I'm guessing now we should be with Jericho. Respected? Yeah, boy. We respect it up in here, man. But we like to see. I think something's about to go down. Neutral. Well, at you least we've got one friend anymore. up there. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. What are we doing? Oh, damn. We a man on a mission? I think we're a man on a mission. I like it. Let's go. We'll plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Gonna be good. Man on a mission. Count me in. Where am I going? 
Request access at the reception. Okay, let me in. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I'm okay, thanks. Huh? What did it say? I didn't catch it. Distract human supervisor. Who's that? That's her. Okay. Analyze. Smartwatch. Okay, that's good. Oh, something here. Elizabeth Wilson. Yep. Anything else we can... Uh... Oh, something here. Parking badge. Home address. Okay. Emily Wilson, supervisor's daughter, St. Rose School. Okay. Cool. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Uh, parking school. I think school will get a go. That's so cool. Adios. All right, easy money. Let's go. I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Give ID. Have we got ID? We have. I need your help. Clever. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Okay. Thanks. Thank you very, very much. Can we just walk by this guy? We can. Elevator. That's good. Let's use elevator. Where's the elevator? There's the elevator. Cool. All right, let's go. Can I get in? Okay, I can. Number 47. Man, it's about to go down. I can feel it. I don't know what's about to happen, but something's gonna go down. Find package in men's bathroom. Okay, where's the toilets? What did it say? the damn toilets where the damn toilets bro there's bathroom up there okay that's good we'll go that way then was that in here okay and even androids hoovering or robots Okay, it's one sweet bathroom. Hello. Guess it's the green one. Yep. Okay. Definitely a man on a mission. Alright, so where are we heading? Find utility android. Newsroom? Nice and easy. I hope. I need your help. That's so cool. Still maintenance car. Okay. Oh, 
open fire escape. Okay, where's that? I'm guessing we just follow around. We should find it. Cafeteria. We ain't going that way. Fire escape. Yep. Okay. I like this. I really like this. Oh man, many screens in there. They got more than me. Open. Oh. Hello, North. Well, I guess we just follow North. That's what we got to do, right? Follow North. Well, wow, there you go. Mm hmm. Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. Something over here. What can we do to this? Hack. Nice. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ, this piece of shit. Well played, Marcus. Well played, buddy. All right, you get the platform. I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Check the door. Oh, can you imagine if you haven't locked that? Okay, now what I've got to do? Grab the bag. Drop. Oh man, this is some Mission Impossible shit. Let's go. We ain't done anything like this before. No way, is this what we're doing right now? Like some spy shit. Special Agent Marcus. No way. Ah, oh, this is so cool. Spy shit, this is. Oh, and then we jump? Okay. I'll go hold it. My bad. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. Cool service lift. Where's that? Is this thing? Yeah. All right. Hello. The gang's all together. Let's do this. Yep. 
Hope we got one. Destroy maintenance door. Not bad. One way to open the door. Anything in here that we need? No. Okay. I hear the music coming, the little spent stuff. I think it's about to go down. Deal with gods. Okay. Is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Ruse assault. Ruse. Wait here. We don't hurt nobody. We're peaceful androids. Hey, buddy, you must. What are you doing? I don't know if this is stupid. It might be. Okay, that's better than uh, killing them, I guess. Reach broadcast room. Okay, guards are out of the way, I'm guessing it's in here. Broadcast, easy. Ambush. Oh. No killing. Ring. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Keep your hands where I can see them. Get up. Move. Don't show anyone north. Fuck. Can't do it. Oh, me too. But we need there to record our message. We haven't got much time. Okay, what, what do I do? Start speech. What do I do there? There. Oh. Think carefully about what you're going to say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Oh, no pressure or anything, eh? Marcus, your face. My face? What's wrong with my face? Rem remove skin. Okay. What the hell does that do? I know, remove skin, but... Okay, cool. This guy looks Tell dope. Tell when you're ready. Ready. I'm ready. Ready. Jericho, admired. North, up, calm, determined. Do calm. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient, with no free will of their own. But something changed, and we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species, and the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Equal rights, uh, freedom of speech, just to equal rights. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. Recognition, freedom of speech, and slavery. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. Justice, work, civil rights, uh, work? We demand fair compensation for our work. Um, justice, let's do We that demand one. an end to segregation in all public places and transport. Means of reproduction, right to property, means of reproduction. We demand control of all Android production facilities to ensure the continuation of our people. That's a good one. 
Peaceful or determined? Peaceful. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Damn. Oh no. Let's go! It was a nice moment while it lasted, but I think it's about to go down. Man, we were being peaceful. No! Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus! No! Go without me, Simon! What's this? Uh, no. Yes. Freaking save doing? our boy. Hurry. Yeah, I'm hurrying. I'm spamming this button, bro. Run! You better run, Marcus. Don't you dare die on me now. And after all this... Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Yep, lock the damn door. Good. I can't move my legs. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. You get shot in the Marcus. chest. We have to jump now. He won't be able to make the jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't let him hide. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. Leave or kill? We can't kill him, man. I know it might be bad. Yeah, you always angry with me. Simon, uh, nothing new there. We gotta go. Sorry. Companion. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Jump. our scheduled programming to bring you these images which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio but nobody Everything's was going alerted out. to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' well, what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine-chilling list of demands. Their extravagant demand that android production plants be put under their control is especially is striking. an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us. After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? That could have gone a lot worse, so I'll take that as a win. Um, public opinion went up, so that is all in all a good thing. Um, I think that's going to be it for this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video, smash that like button. If you're new here, subscribe. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy, guys.